I've waited years to actually go clamping. It's only a blessing that I'm getting to do it right here in the kingdom. Welcome to our clamping tent. Come on in. The statement right when you walk in is the bed. I just love the art that it is. And then on the side, you have a drawer. This is where we're actually going to put in some of our stuff. And then there's the dressing table. It comes with a chair and a mirror. So just for you to get ready all the way into the room. There's two side tables that look exactly alike. When you walk in, <laughs> your first impression is this is all the room offers, right? Well. You're very wrong because it has a bathroom. This is the shower and I like this thing as well. I think this is where you put your towels and stuff. This uh, lock thing and then there's this light, bathroom light, so cute and so artistic. And then you obviously have your sink and another mirror. I love the thing that they did with this log here. It's just a whole art on its own. It's very cute. And then the toilet of course very necessary important stuff <laughs> and then right outside the tent is this super cool seating area it actually looks like a bed we move to the kitchen area come on in so first is this super cute sitting area right here you can sit here and enjoy your drinks also your morning coffee you come here this super cute bench um, that seats like a group of people you can sit here and enjoy your afternoon meal your morning meal whatever meal you come into the kitchen there's a fully fleshed kitchen y'all it's half inside half outside kitchen it gives you like um this experience that you're actually cooking outside and that is just super cool it is roofed 100 percent roofed but it also has um open sides anyway we'll start here with the stove you comes with the stove I think it's gas um, powered it's a gas powered stove and then there's obviously the sink where you can clean your um, dishes and your cutlery it comes with cutlery fully flesh knives everything and then for um, uh, your breakfast or your bread you have a toaster and then you have a kettle to boil your water oh I forgot to tell you the bedrooms actually come with hot water bottles. So if it gets chilly at night, you have a hot water bottle to keep you warm at night. And you have a kettle here to boil your water. There's a fridge. It has, um, it has your dip freezer and then it has your normal <laughs> fridge side. I don't know what it's called. And then there's the cupboard. So here, you get your dishes you get your your mugs um your glasses i love the way this place is so artistic the the design of the furniture the design of the whole place is just so artistic <laughs> The people here are so nice. I am just wow. This kind man just made us a fire. Dinner's almost ready. But they don't know how I feel. Oh, babe. Now we've just had dinner and we are about to chill, enjoy the fire before we go to bed. Oh, the way you make oh me baby. Oh, baby. Oh, yes, I'm darling. They can say what they want about me and you. Well, it is shower time, so I'm gonna go take a shower, but I need to show you one of the coolest showers I've ever seen. Oh, 
everything that I prayed for, you're a dream come true, baby. So let's do a quick bathroom tour. So the first thing that you come to is the sign. This is what you walk into. This is the shower. Look at that. And then the toilet. And now where we were meant to be. But they don't know how I feel. showered i'm refreshed and i'm ready to start my day so i just want to tour the place around and see what more it has to offer So apparently this place started off as a craft center. They had a workshop for handcraft stuff. It was called Rosecraft. I think I've actually seen some of their products um, in some shops around. Anywho, that is how the place started and then they um, advanced it into a lodge. This place has quite the scenery, the nature, views, the mountains, everything. And also the place is just nicely decorated with super awesome landscaping that just brings such an atmosphere. Well, that was a fun tour, but it's time to make breakfast. We're just gonna reheat last night's meat and have it as breakfast. just woke up that's why my bed is not made up yet but yeah I'm about to go make some coffee wake up properly <laughs> and watch the sunrise our brine master mr. Snandel is making sure that our meat doesn't burn the voice is getting a bit dramatic though with its fat lighting up the fire <laughs> but he's got it under control <laughs> 